Can you explain what TuneCore does? Yes, TuneCore is, is actually the best and one of the largest distributors in the world. It is. Actually, we're the most international. You know, we have regions, we have representatives on the ground in 18 different countries across five continents and catering to artists' needs. Some of these other distributors, they distribute your music, but there's no one there to work it. You said distributor. What are you talking about? Okay, distributor of music. So when you when you buy your favorite artist music or you receive it on these digi digital platforms, TuneCore are the guys who's distributing it to them. So they're the ones that get it from the artist or the artist submits it. Yes. They're the mechanism to get it onto Apple Music, Spotify, right. whatever. Right, so your favorite artist can make money and pay their bills. So TuneCore, we're also the, the only distribution company that gives 100%. So a lot of these other distributors, they claim that they give 100%, but they don't. 100% of? Of your profit. It's all okay. yours. There's no one, there's no 80-20, there's no 70-30, no 60-40, none of that. So when you release your music as an independent artist, you make all of your revenue. You only pay to upload the music. So, and what's that cost for, let's say I wanted to be a rapper now, mm -hmm. and I'm going to put out a record. What's the cost for me to put my song up on? $10. So I pay TuneCore $10. Yes, if you want to upload To use a song. their platform. Yes. Boom, my and, song is everywhere. Yes, and what TuneCore has done in conjunction with me, we did a campaign where we allow artists to pay $30 for the year, something around $30 something or whatever, and you can upload as much content as you want. So it's almost like I, I'm, year. A, I'm a member, I'm a subscriber to yes. TuneCore, and I can yes. just go crazy. It's the best option for, for all independent artists out there. You know, these, like I said earlier, these guys, they say they give 100%, but they use a middleman. So, and they're cutting your money. It's not, it's not the real revenue. They say they give artists 100% revenue, but they're cutting it, and by the time you get it, it's already diluted, so you're not really making your, your profit. Uh, and I want to get into understanding that part of the business because sure. I don't even understand that part. But I put out an album that has 10 songs. Am I paying $10 per song if I put out an album through TuneCore? So is that no. why it's better for me to go ahead and do the $30 for the year? It's definitely better for you to do the $30 for the year. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Uh, it's, a, it's another fee for a full album, but if you want to upload a song, it's $10. Got it. But a full album will be a little more, but it, it's, it's your best option as right. an artist because you're not splitting your money with nobody after. You done spent all this money in the studio, spent all your hard work on the road doing all this, and then you're splitting your profit. For what? You can come to TuneCore and make all that profit yourself. When you go and you sit with an artist mm -hmm. as a representative of TuneCore, um, what are you talking to most? What are most artists asking you? Like, because uh, I don't even know. But for the purpose of this convo, there's people watching. Right. I need to figure out a how to get my stuff on the streaming platforms. But b yes. what what else do well, I? Well, so many like, artists have the the mentality of you know they want to become successful. The first thing they think is I need a record deal, mm. and that's outdated. Unfortunately, I'm I'm sorry to, to tell everyone that's outdated. You don't need to sign your life away to no uh, record label, and then. You're, they're, you're signing your YouTube off. They're monetizing your YouTube. That's, a, that's one of the first things these guys take from artists. And um, that's your bread and butter right there. You can make so much revenue off of that. So what I'm explaining to them is you don't need to depend on anyone or look at this as a dream. You need to make this your reality. Right. And part of that process is w once you record your music, once you go into the studio and make that investment, now you release it through a, a place like TuneCore where we have direct relationships with the DSPs. You understand? Mm -hmm. These other guys, they have a middleman, what they use as a clearinghouse, mm. where they're cutting the revenue and then it's Paying not... Paying somebody else to then talk yeah, to Yeah, they, they, they're taking your money, they're doing what a middleman does, taking their profit, and then they give it to you. So it's not really the full revenue. When you go to a place like TuneCore, you release your music and you're really independent. Let's say your February album costs you five grand in total, okay? Mm -hmm. Hypothetical. You put that up on TuneCore, right? Honestly, it doesn't even cost me that much. But I'm just throwing honest. out numbers. Got you, got you. How much money did you make? Because you said you came on here and told us that 2021, when you dropped 12 albums, was the best you ever did in music. It was the best thing I did for so many reasons, for so many different reasons. Beyond monetary. Beyond that, yeah. You just see, the, look at the opportunities it created for me, just being consistent. It right. kept me busy. Um, the monetary game was amazing. 